Many of us in our lives want to be more intentional with what's happening in our lives. Great book here, Life by Design, and the author, Teresa Lewis, joins us today. She's also going to be speaking here today, again, at the Women's Valley Expo. Come down and join us noon to 9 today, 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. tomorrow, right here at the Fargo Dome. We all know it's free tonight. Might as well come down and have a great time and grow, have some personal growth. Good morning. Thanks Absolutely. for being here. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. This is really exciting, and the venue is looking amazing. Let me just say that. This is really looking fabulous. It's warm inside. <laughs> it is a great place to be because, you know what, you'll be surrounded by a lot of inspiration, encouragement, fun, and excitement. Let's talk about what you're going to be sharing today. I think many of us wake up every day with a certain intention about going out and, you know, making some things happen, and then all of a sudden life hits you, and you're like, Yes. Whoa, that didn't quite go as I thought. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. And we get disillusioned, and then we have fear and doubt, rejection, failure, setbacks. And then over time, you kind of think, you know what? Is this all there is? Is this it? And you begin to just start settling and becoming complacent. So we don't want that. We want to change that up and get back to that intentional living, life by design, start dreaming again, start thinking, what if? And then move toward that, start taking steps. So that's really the basis of the book, and it's the basis of my session today, Life by, De Life by Design. I also have another session that I'm talking about today, and that's the seven mindsets, which, of course, we've shared in the past on, on this show as well. Nice. So do you have any... Go ahead. Go ahead. Do you have any tips? I mean, you know, again, as you hit those bumps on the road during the day, are you going to give us some tips on how to overcome those things, and can you share a couple with us now? Oh, definitely. You know, and part of it is just focusing on what you can control. So stepping back and saying, can I control this situation or not? And then taking control of that and saying, guess what I can control here? My mindset, my attitude, my thoughts, my words, my perspective. I get to control all of that. I can't control what's going on around me, so I'm just going to let that go. Letting go with uh, certain people in your life, too, is not a bad idea. <laughs> not a bad idea at all. Very critical for your own sanity. <laughs> you said sometimes. that with some great intention, Andrea. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you don't want to know. <laughs> right. Everybody's got a story related to that, I think. <laughs> That's good. Um, any, anything else you want to add? You know, I think it's just like a session like this, all of these are going to be so fun, so inspiring, so amazing, and you're going to leave with such great ideas, but the key will always be action, implementation, and accountability. That's the only way I got the book done. I had a coach to hold me accountable, and she held me to it, and she said, get it done. You said December 31st, let's get it done. So we I'm, did. I'm assuming you're going to talk a little bit about that today. I mean, I, I, you know, I grew up playing sports, and I always talked about Michael Jordan, Tiger Woods, yeah. even the best of the best. The one thing they all have in common is they have a coach. So. Just quickly, we've got about a minute left, but talk about the importance of having that accountability partner. Oh, it's huge because, you know, you voice what you want, and then they do hold you accountable to that. And they kind of, you know, even when I coach too, it's like, well, why do you want what you want? Let's get back and revisit that. Why did you want this originally? How do we get you back to that point? Focus on your why, and then the mechanics of how to get there. And then you've got that person along the way that says, hey, I'm here to help you, cheer you on, and hold you to it. Great stuff. Let's, let's tell everyone again um, the times that you're speaking today. 2 o'clock and 3.30, and then we'll have, um, I'll be around, you know, for a lot this afternoon as well, too. So, uh, but yeah, main stage, 2 o'clock, 3.30, so it's going to be a lot of fun. And can they um, uh, find your book somewhere, too? I bet it's in the author's nook. It is in the author's nook, and then, which is here today, very exciting, and then on my website at TeresaInspires.com. Again, thank the book is you. Life by Design. Yeah, thank you for being here. It should be a great Thank you great so much. Day. So yeah, we appreciate it's going to be it. fun. So come on out. Thanks, Teresa. Uh, stay with us, and we come back. The host of Coffee Talk. Jamie Premax Sullivan is going to be with us again. Come down and join us today, noon to nine, right here at the Fargo Dome for the Women's Valley Women's Expo. We want to see you here. <laughs>